welcome to an insanely special video. Today, we play Piggy Intercity, which is apparently a new Piggy open world gaming experience on Roblox. I have no idea other than that. It's an open world Piggy game. So let's jump right in and play it for the first time. Welcome back to the Resolution. Yes, I'm your host. Hopefully you understood that. Today we are playing Piggy Intercity. Again, like I said, it's an open world Piggy game and I'm just gonna hit play. I have no idea how to play. I've only seen a few things about this game. You can make your own Piggy, which is what I'm the most excited about. I actually had a Piggy in the RB Battles Piggy event. Pretty cool. But now we're gonna make our own Piggy in this game. I have no idea what this game entails. All I know is I, I kinda wanna move my face cam over to this side just for this episode so that you know maybe it's better over here maybe it's maybelline do you guys like it i don't know by the way if you guys are new to the channel make sure you subscribe hit that notification bell i upload two vids every single day and of course if you haven't already smash the like button if you guys want to see me play this game more i totally will but without further ado i have the music muted by the way um i didn't know if there was any way to like mute the music just in game but i have it all the way down so not sure if it's copywritten but we'll change it for next episode so look at this, you can become any of the characters from Piggy and you can customize yourself completely. I kind of want to be like the traditional Piggy. I kind of want to be like the traditional Piggy, but at the same time, like Draft, bro? Draffy's looking pretty sick. And I also like this guy. Um, I'm not really sure who I want to be. I'm, I'm, I might keep it classic and just be Piggy, guys. I think I'm going to keep it classic, be George Pig. But here is where you can get the outfit you can get the Peppa outfit, you can get the manly outfit. Look at this, manly piggy, hoodie piggy. Bro, I like the hoodie piggy. Except, oh, I can make it blue. My piggy's gonna be wearing a blue hoodie. Dude, look at this. Ready? That is sick. My piggy's literally matching. And then all I need is like, you know, the actual logo to be on there and we're good to go. <laughs> Wait, what's maroon? The Oh, the, the undershirt. Okay, Um, is there a lighter blue? Maybe I should go even lighter. Um, maybe cyan's best. Maybe cyan. Ooh, that one's pretty good, though. Pastel blue. What do you think? I don't know, guys. There's so many. Oh, that one's pretty close. That one's pretty close to blue hoodie. I don't know if I want to go cyan or not. It's tough. I might go pastel. Light blue. That looks pretty good. And then the cyan undershirt, even though you can't see it. That looks pretty good so far. What looks best with the blue, though? Like, there might be another piggy that looks better. I don't know. This is cool. I don't want to spend too much time on the customization, but the fact that you can do this is really cool. There's also hats, but maybe you have to unlock these because I don't actually see any of them uh, here, unless that's something else. Yeah, that's that's hats, but I don't I don't think I have any. And here are the pants. You can have pants, you can have shorts, and then you can have like, you know, uh, what are those called? Capris, where they're not really fully down. I'm going to go with some pants, and I'm going to go, since I wear Adidas pants all the time, I'm going to go black pants. And I'm gonna go, uh, yeah, I guess I can't put anything else here. I kinda wanna go a, a, a more blue though. I kinda wanna go cyan, you know what I mean? I'm thinking I might need to go cyan because that looks like more blue. And now I can name it Russo. Go. Yes! And that is my character. So that's how you begin the game. Instead of playing the game like rounds, you actually join the game and create your character. And here I am. Here I am in the piggy universe as Russo. That is my guy. And look at this. Who's this? Wait, why does he say Russo? Hey, Russo. I got golden antlers of honor. Wait, is this guy's name Russo too? This guy's name is Russo? I want to be Russo. Is his name actually Russo with an exclamation mark? <laughs> That's hilarious. All right. So as we can see when we first join the game, what's in here? Can we go in here? Oh, you can. So you can explore. Not sure if there's any secrets. If you guys found anything or have any tips, definitely let me know. So you can actually open doors and explore. I don't know if you can like pick anything up or, or do anything like that, but it looks like you have a emote thing where you can express emotion, which I love. And then you have an inventory right here with Q. And then you have um, like inventory slots that you can equip things for. And um, you also have health, uh, poison and something else. I'm not really sure exactly what those are. I think we'll learn as we go. Make sure you like the video if you haven't already, guys. Okay, so we start off in this camp. It looks like this, like, safe camp, and there's a shop. You can buy weapons. Wait, can you buy this right away? It says it's zero coins. 
Maybe I can buy that right away. And then supplies and then clothing. Um, It's not letting me buy that. Do I have it? Oh, <laughs> it let me buy a ton of them. Okay, I can drop these. I actually bought a ton of sticks. I'm just gonna hold like three and I'm gonna equip this and let's go to one. There it is. Oh, look at that stick pickup. They have that nice little like E feature. That's actually pretty nice looking like the, the UI for it. Okay, okay. Again, I don't have the volume on because I'm scared that it's gonna be like copywritten sounds. This is rash. So I don't know if these are other players or not. I'm actually not sure, but I'm not sure if I should just start fighting them or what. There is an area, oh, talk. Um, I can talk to this dead body here. <laughs> it's like talk and they're like completely like dead. All right, I'm sorry about you. Let's go ahead and go this way. This is gonna teleport me out of the safe zone. So that's the safe zone. And now I am just in the wilderness as a piggy ready to just fight anybody in my way i guess that's that's basically what i'm gonna do here and i'm wearing blue apparel <laughs> i love it all right so i don't know if i should just start fighting people or what but um i don't think there's any other controls other than jump i don't think you can sprint look there's somebody over there and there's something over there i don't know if i'm supposed to explore or not oh there's something over there okay and there's a big building all right, I'm gonna go this way and talk to this person right here. I'm assuming there's probably things that you can loot, things that you can do to earn money because there was a shop and it looks like these are depleting. Wait, oh, oh, I bought something. Okay, I killed it. I, I don't really know what that did um, and I don't know why it was attacking me out of nowhere, but yeah, that was the thing. That was, that was kind of scary. That was kind of scary, I'm not gonna lie. Look at my hoodie, dude, I love this. So it looks like these are all enemies all around the place some of them might be players but they're all like enemies there's a city over here and then there's also stuff over there i'm gonna go that way soon let's go this way first and see what we can explore um over here what is happening bro it's like changing there's a mountain i have no idea the point of this game i'm gonna be completely honest on the description it just says it's a demo there's gonna be things added like quests and story missions and base building etc but there's none of that now explore the open world of pity inner city and discover the mysteries between behind the infection that plagues it. So there is a little bit of a storyline with this as we talk to NPCs. I guess we'll figure that out. Oh, what is that over there? Is that a jail? I don't know what's over there. Let, let's hop in here. This is like my first experience of actually finding like a city. Oh, snap. Okay, so there's people over there. I wish I had a car. Oh, look, there's actually builds from Piggy. So there's actually builds from Piggy in the game and you can explore and sort of like experience the chapters in like a different point of view. Oh my gosh, I got a hammer. So you can find other things. Dude, that's amazing. I also, oh, so killing that enemy, I got a coin for it, guys. So you actually do get stuff. Um, what's over here? Is there a secret button? <laughs> Remember the secret button for RB battles? Whoa, you can go outside here, nice. Um, yeah, there's nothing here though. Hmm. I don't think there's anything I can pick up. Oh, I can pick up that can. I got that can of food. Oh, this is your hunger. Is it? Let me see. So if I hit two, there we go. That one's your hunger. I'm assuming this one is like your water. So you probably have to replenish hunger and water and you have to find stuff to heal you. And you'll probably start going down in health if, if, if it diminishes too much. Okay, okay, nice, nice. So now we're finding it. We're figuring it out. Guys, I'm becoming a piggy pro. I actually could see this becoming a really big game as they add stuff over time. So I'm super excited. Is there a secret button? No secret buttons. Oh, well, I guess I'm just gonna keep exploring and, and hopefully I can find something that I can take with me. Now I'm curious, if you find, like say I find that hammer. Ooh, a water bottle. Nice, that's what I'm gonna need. I am going to need that very soon. Let's just drink it now. So, yep, that's my water. So if I find that water bottle and somebody else is in my server and they find it, do they also get it or is it gone? Or does it like respawn on a timer? Like if you guys have played with somebody else and you guys both got the item, let me know because I'm really curious how that works. Is it like true open world where like first come first serve? Ah! Oh my gosh, I'm assuming the people without names are NPCs. So let's fight this guy, taking out my health. But we just killed it, let's go. And we got a coin for it. Nice. Sorry there's no audio of me fighting, but 
I just, again, I cannot have uh, this copyright sound, you know what I'm saying? I also really like the eyes. I think they're animated. Yeah, it's like, it looks really good. I like the way this is made, dude. I didn't expect all this. Is there anything else I can take here? I have a crowbar now. <gasps> a bat. That's gonna be, wait, is that what I already have? <laughs> oh no, those are sticks. The bat is better. The bat is 20 damage. So the bat is gonna help me out. I don't know if things diminish over time, actually. I don't think they do. So let's equip the bat. The bat is gonna be really good. Let's go, dude. Oh, and another thing. I got ammo. So now if I find an assault rifle, I actually have a bullet for it. And that implies that there's assault rifles in here, which is kind of insane. Oh my gosh, there's so much to explore. I don't think I'm ever gonna find it all. There's definitely gonna be multiple videos on this game. So if you guys wanna see more, smash the like button and subscribe. I'm gonna make my way over to that other area. Like I'm gonna go this way and then I'm gonna go to that other area and see if there's anything that we can find and explore over there and see if there's any- The evil version of me. Nice. So every time you kill something, again, you get like a coin for right now. Oh, you do level up too. That's awesome. I really like that. I like that you level up. I like that you get experience. I love games like that. Now, I don't know if these are all NPCs. I think they are. And I guess all NPCs attack you. So it looks like this police department is really packed with enemies, which is not good. I'm gonna have to run around this. This is gonna be bad. But I bet you I'll find some good loot here. I bet you I'll find some really good items here. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Okay, there's a lot of stuff in here. There's a lot of people in here. Oh no. Oh no. They're doing a lot of damage. They are doing a lot of damage. Okay, I'll fight one at a time. One at a time. The bat is so good. The bat is actually insane. Come at me, come at me, come at me, nerds. Die, 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 die. Oh, I leveled up. Let's go. Okay, really strong bunny here. Really strong bunny here. Nice, got him. Easy, easiest game of my life. I'm so good. Free, you're so free. Dog water, dog water. <laughs> Anyways, um, oh, there's water over there. We need that, we need that. Nice. I don't know if your health regenerates over time, um, but I do know, oh, and can you stand in this? There's no like toxic waste in there. Maybe you can stand in that, in this map. I'm not really sure. Is there anything over here? No, no. All right. There is something over here though, and it's water. Let's grab that. Now I got a lot of stuff. The thing is your inventory fills up, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, make sure I have that equipped. Let's get that, let's go three, let's drink up, and let's explore the rest of this. Dude, I actually really like the way this is. Like, I think this could turn into a massive game. I'm excited, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments how far you got, what you think, and what you, you played and thought and think and thunk. And um, maybe we can meet up in Piggy Inner City sometime. Oh my gosh. So I got a pickaxe. Now, I don't know if that is implying that there's gonna be some sort of like mining and maybe down the line, there'll be like resource gathering and stuff or if it's literally just another weapon. I don't really know what that is, but that could be a thing. It could be like resource gathering. The reason you wanna pick up everything most likely is because I think you can sell stuff. And if you sell stuff, you'll make money and you can buy other items, I think. I'm not entirely sure, I guess we'll see, but I have some really good loot right now. Let's start, Let's make our way to that last area that I've never gone to yet. And we're gonna see what's in store there. So I'm basically gonna run like really, really far. It looks like these NPCs don't respawn right away, which is good. Come at me, what do you want, what do you want? Oh, I'm hungry, I'm hungry. I need food. Can I eat some bunny meat? <laughs> yeah, I don't really have any food unless I can eat hammers in this game. So I'm gonna run all the way over the mountain into that area. I might have to stop at camp first and we'll see what's over there. Oh, look, there's a bunch of players. So players have names above their head. There's a bunch of players. I don't know if they're gonna like, I don't know if they're killing each other or what, but those are all players. Players with the names above their head. The rest of them are not players. That's actually hilarious. What's up, guys? So mine says Russo. There is a big area over there, and there's a little camp thing right here. I'm gonna go here and see if there's any food. If not, I'm gonna be in a bad position. Like, we're about to see what happens when your hunger is depleted. <laughs> 
because I have no idea. That's kind of like me in real life right now. My hunger is about to be depleted, but at least Meg's going to get food right now. Um, right area. Nice. So I don't know if there's anything to interact with other than grabbing stuff, but I need some food, bro. I need some food fast and even water. Like I guess running just depletes it quickly. Nice. Okay, can of food. That's what I needed. Three. Let's see how much it, it gives you. Oh, it doesn't give you that much. Oh man. All right. Um, any water? Nope. Anything in here? No, no, no. This ain't good. Wait, there's something over here. I haven't checked this, and I haven't actually checked that treehouse. So let's check this area just to make sure there's nothing in this ice secret cave. Nope. You can't grab the fire. I wonder if the fire hurts you. This is super cool. I did not expect this. It's like all the piggy maps combined to make this open. Ah! <laughs> ah! Oh no. I cannot take all these guys right now. I can't take them all. Oh, I thought I could collect this item. I can't take these guys. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh no. I'm totally dead. I'm totally dead. I gotta run. I gotta run. And there's NPCs over here. Yeah, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Come on, man, run, run, run. I need to make it back to camp. I need to make it back to camp and I have literally four NPCs on my tail. There's no way. There's no way, wait, what's this? Oh my gosh, what's this? Somebody dropped a package for me. It's literally food and water. <gasps> water, food. Ah, okay, okay. Thank you for helping, thank you for helping. All right, equip. Whip. Oh my gosh. Three. Dude, somebody hooked it up. But wait, I'm poisoned. Why am I poisoned? Oh no. I don't know why I'm poisoned. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> make it back to camp. It looks like I got poisoned. I have no idea why, but I need to make it back to camp quickly. I can't take these guys. I can't take these guys. I'm out of here. I'm out. Teleport me back. No! Is it because I'm poisoned? Maybe because I'm poisoned. Oh no. Not good, not good. All right, so you do replenish health when you're at a certain food and, and thirst level. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. I'm so weak. I'm literally one hit. Oh my God, help me! Help me! Why is he not helping me? Help me, man! Bro, right behind you, dude! Somebody help me. Do they see the same enemies as me or what? What's going on here? Why won't they help me? Why won't this person help me? Die. Die. Oh my god. Okay, I made it. Oh no. I got poisoned. I got turned. I turned into a poisonous man. Oh no. Now I fight players. Now I fight players. This is not good. How do I change back? How do I change back? <laughs> All right, well, I don't know why, but I actually got poisoned, so I'm not really sure what happened there, but now I am basically, um, I'm a bad guy. I don't know how I'll change back, but that is something that can happen. I will see you guys in the next video I'm at. I'm ending it right here. Thank you so much for watching. This game is sick. I highly recommend it. Linked in the description, and I'm gonna play some more. Let me know what you guys thought. Two videos every single day. I'll see you next time. Thank you for watching, and stay blue. Bye!